How much was that fancy cup of coffee you bought yourself this morning? Five, maybe six bucks? How much do you make an hour? Seven, maybe 12? Roughly 30% of American workers are making minimum wage. The national minimum wage is $7.25 an hour. Different states vary. 50 years ago, the national minimum wage was $10.90, adjusting for inflation. What happened to that extra three bucks and some change? Let's put it this way. How many minutes of your life did that cup of coffee cost you this morning? 30, maybe 40 minutes? That shot of espresso, did that cost you an hour of your life? You see, you pay for things with time, your time, not money. The price of living is constantly increasing, yet wages stagnate. The average full-time working American clocks in over 47 hours a week. That calculates to about seven hours a day. Include eight hours of sleep, two hours of getting ready and going to work, and that leaves you about seven hours of free time a day. But wait. You still have to cook and clean, take care of the kids, walk the dog, take out the trash, and by the time you're ready to settle in for a two hour movie on the couch, you're exhausted and you go to bed, just so you can wake up and do it all over again. I think there's something wrong with us. Why do Americans work their lives away? The answer is simple, you're being forced to. Kind of funny considering you live in a free country. According to a Princeton study, for the last 30 odd years, American lawn policy has been dictated largely by corporate interests. The guys making 200 to 1,000 times as much as the median worker are the ones making all the rules. So why haven't things changed, you ask? Well, to put it simply, because you won't do anything about it. The system is rigged so that you can't afford to do anything about it. Kind of crappy, huh? Now, picture this. Every American worker wakes up tomorrow morning and decides to stay home. What would happen if no one showed up to work? Curious. I know. I imagine things would change overnight. Better wages, better hours, better benefits. If only we could all work together, we could change something. So the next time you buy that double frappuccino mocha latte with an extra shot of espresso, ask yourself this. How will you be spending your life?